Hi my friends, today we create this model, symmetrical fork, which is in the category sheet metal. You see this is the part, yes. And this is the drawing of this part. We have here the flat pattern, like in the, the previous tutorial, which can be obtained always from the folded part. I'll show you today. We have some uh, dimensions here, and the part is symmetrical with one single one exception this hole which is placed not in the center three millimeters from the center so let's create this face for the start yes remember these dimensions new sheet metal start sketch 2d sketch and now we draw some lines as you can see I use our verified techniques this is small contour we place here four millimeters home the radius is four millimeters 30 degrees radius 20 radius 4 52 millimeters and 20 here let's place these uh, dimensions so I project geometry the two axes X and Y but center line and then that dimensions this is 20 this is 30 degrees Um, 30 52 80 And this is another dimension sixty and only one is missing. Which one? This end. 100 now we have fully constrained yes with a few lines here now we apply fillets four millimeters this corner and 20 the other one And because the uh, sketch is symmetrical, you see we have here fully constrained. Uh, we select all the lines and arcs, and we apply mirror about this axis. This axis. we draw this connection line 
and now the next mirror about the other axis mirror axis apply and lines one two finish sketch and now we have a close contour the thickness in the drawing is uh, here two millimeters so we know the procedure sheet metal defaults disable the thickness from rule because we apply our thickness you have to know that all the rules are referring this thickness our new thickness okay face okay and we have the first volume next is uh, from the drawing this small flange 6 with 45 at a distance of 100 and with a corner round of 3 millimeter this small flange on the whole length let's create it flange this end uh, 6 millimeters 45 not 90 and we have to select the bend position if you take a look at the uh, solution here this is one we don't need this not this neither this but the first the first is with uh, the point at the intersection of these two uh, faces or uh, lines okay F6 then corner round of three we apply and both ends okay now I want to take advantage that we have to mirror here the flange I take advantage to place these two holes to make the mirroring together with the holes dimensions are 50 on 72 for holes of uh, 7 millimeters good this is the face point one two on the same vertical we draw a line between these two points to place its midpoint on the same horizontal with the center now dimensions the line is 50 and the distance from the center is 72 divided by 2 finish sketch hole 7 is already selected through ok now mirror mirror of the flange corner round and holes about this plane ok next 
is uh, this flange but it has not uh, ends uh, perpendicular on the bending line so we have to use another technique we create a contour on the face and we apply a face dimensions are 27 120 these two lines are uh, equal yes and the distance inside is 30 we create a sketch on this face we draw two lines from the ends up horizontal down they are equal and the angle is 120 the dimension from the base is 27 finished sketch now I apply face of this but not to the interior but to the exterior because we know that this is 30 already okay we have a nice connection between this new flange and the uh, rest of part again corner round three up and up okay then the hole point somewhere here three millimeters you remember from the center and 15 from the bottom Fifteen and three diameter of nine finish sketch hole nine okay now we mirror this last flange with the hole and corner rounds mirror of one two one two three features about this plane okay f6 that's the part my friends let's apply steel carbon and polished to be nice still polished you see the part is very nice I properties physical update copy the value of the volume and compare with this text text here paste okay exactly the same control Z let's see what about the flat pattern the flat pattern can be obtained by using this tool yeah. click on it and you have the flat pattern you can uh, uh, impose the order of bending you see if you 
use this uh, tool, you have an order. If you want to change them, for instance, to place this to be the first, click on it, enable, and change, place here one. And now one, three, two. I want this to be the second. Yes, and uh, this will uh, appear on the drawing. To go back to the folded part, you use this tool, F6. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.